NBC 10's mm -hmm. Fred Shropshire is joining us now with more on this exclusive conversation, Fred. It was an amazing conversation, amazing mm -hmm. speech with many quotables. Yeah. That's how you know, right? We'll be talking about this for some time. Yes, Jason says that it is no coincidence that the best years of his football life have coincided with him meeting his wife, Kylie, a decade ago. Kylie tells us what it was like to see her husband call it a career. I think I was the only one that had heard the speech before we went into it. Kylie Kelsey had a front row seat to her husband's captivating retirement speech on Monday. I think it was just uh, a perfect summary of 13 years. Thank you, Philadelphia. From the bottom of my heart. I always say he's not from here, but he gets it. So um, that was the perfect example. In a speech filled with emotion, perhaps the part that connected most was Jason's expression of love towards Kylie, who Jason first met after an Eagles Christmas party filled with holiday cheer. I still remember the moment she walked through the door. The first instance is burned in my retina. It was like she glided through the opening. It, of course, made me emotional. It cracks me up that he tries to talk about what he remembers from that night because he was, as I've said before, intoxicated. Then she started talking. And I thought, man, is this what love feels like? It was very, very sweet, very kind. Um, it was far too much credit. Jason's retirement speech joins his Art Museum Super Bowl parade speech as one of the iconic moments in the career of a player like no other before him in Philadelphia sports. Kylie tells us he's been working on it for a while. I've heard uh, multiple versions over the last four years. Um, this was a completely different version. I think every year he sort of started from scratch as to what was sitting on the surface. Um, but when he said that he was contemplating retirement for years, he means for years. And Jason delivered with a speech for the ages. Thank you for letting me represent this city. Generating a tidal wave of responses. The outpouring of love and support is expected because I know who my husband is and the way he has conducted himself and how that has touched the lives of people. Um, but at the same time, it's still shocking. Now, Kylie is an athlete herself, so her main sport is field hockey. So today, Kylie was gracious enough to serve as a reporter for us here at NBC10 on an upcoming story about the Team USA field hockey team. She took the field with a pair of local Olympic hopefuls and did a great job. We'll have that full drive for gold story coming up next month. But just an incredible story. You know, we're talking about yeah. this speech, mm -hmm. and there are all kinds of moments it was a love story about football, about family, yes. his wife there. I really appreciated how he gave the shout out to his dad. Yeah. You know, his dad is incredible. He said, uh, mm -hmm. a loving, present father who is devoted to their children is perhaps the greatest gift we can give our society. Mm. Really appreciated that. Yeah. yeah. And we didn't think anything could compare to that Super Bowl parade At the speech. Art Museum, yeah. In the mummer's yeah. uniform. But this had a completely different context, yeah. but just as impactful. And so genuine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, vastly different. Always. Yeah. Really good. Always. Mm, Fred, thank you.